Today we're going to start off with um, our content purpose, which is to analyze and interpret the Mayflower Compact. So in your teams, you're going to be looking at the actual document. The greatest thing I love is working with the kids. Um, it's great to interact with them. And um, you should have found it's exciting for me to work with them. And it, it gives me great pleasure to see um, them engaged in the different documents and the different times of history that we study in my class. OK, combine themselves into their civil body politics. So why would that be important for them? She teaches everything so clearly. You could understand anything that she's teaching. She teaches it in detail. So what was the purpose of the Mayflower Compact? Go ahead, Michaela. I really Just like learning about the history that she teaches. Like, when she does stuff, if you have problems, she makes sure you understand the lesson, and she's really good at, like, teaching you what's going on. Excellent. OK, so what are some quotes that we could use, which is your next question? She clears everything out of the way. like. If you have like a problem with something, she'll just help you and make it super clear, super just straight up. It'll help you really a lot with history. What again? Who can refresh us? What does that mean that they're combining a civil body politics, Spencer? She's a smart teacher. She helps us when we have any problems. Like every time, like I need help, like she's there and she tells us like anything that will help us. To make a new colony. To make a new colony. Okay, so they're creating a new colony. What else, Sierra? She's amazing. She's an amazing lady, first of all. She's taught um, all level of students, and she's taught seventh grade, she's taught eighth grade. But what she does, she makes learning relevant. She, she makes it to real to the students. I've got one that I would like to ask. Go ahead. How was life back then? Yeah, I've always wanted to uh, teach uh, since I was in college uh, because I love history so much, and I wanted to share my passion with that subject with the students. Did they give any input when they were creating this document? She speaks everything so clearly. She teaches it to you, to your face, and stuff like that. So she just walks you through what you need to do. Yep. It feels amazing to have a teacher who actually cares about your education and who actually wants you to succeed in life. I would say the best part of it is at the end of the school year when I see the growth in the students. Uh, it's really, really rewarding for me as a teacher to, um, to, to witness that and be a part of that. She's very like into learning. Like you wouldn't, you come to her class, there's no days that you wouldn't feel like you haven't learned anything. She's just a great teacher. She makes everything very clear. It's great. And you can hear some of the students when they talk with you that they love being in that classroom. They make, she makes learning fun. She makes it relevant. She makes it have meaning to them. So she's just an amazing lady. The old outfits. What else? I think the greatest thing that I want them to take away from my class is a love of learning, but not only learning, but a deeper appreciation for the subject that I teach, which is American history. Um, it's important, I think, for them to understand, you know, the, the sacrifices that a lot of people have made for us to live in this country. Okay, women maybe didn't have rights. Were they participants in whatever's going on here? She's nice. She teaches everything really clearly, like I said before. She just has like a really good personality. And just it looks like they're. Yeah, I'm glad to have Miss Bosnian because she's like she has like a really good spirit, and she's like she just is really nice, and she's not like one of those teachers who are like really strict. She makes sure you have fun and you learn in her classroom. Teams will collaborate when analyzing the text to complete the Mayflower Complex. I've worked in the private sector, uh, but I love teaching uh, in the classroom with the kids because it just it's really exciting and invigorating for me as a person to witness them learning and to see that spark when they get something which I'm teaching. The teachers, like, they don't look like they would like, sometimes they just stand there and just talk to you, but she shows a lot of compassion. It's great. But she's an amazing lady. The students love her and they learn well from her. So everything about her is great. Hey guys, when you're ready. Because, you know, having the teacher of the year means that she's been working hard and it'll help you. Okay, so uh, on Friday we talked about. Yeah, I love teaching. I love teaching. It's a great, uh, it's a great 
uh, profession to be in, especially when we're, we're working with young people to see them grow. Compact was an important document in American history. It established the first rules and laws and uh, type of government that eventually will lead to other development of governments.